the question says the particle is released from height s from the surface of the earth at a certain instant its kinetic energy is three times its potential energy the height from the surface of earth and the speed of the particle at that instant are respectively so i can say this is the surface of earth and this is the point where the body is released so i can say this is height s so at some instant i can say this is the height s so at some instant let's say this let's call that height as h this is the instant where the kinetic energy is 3 times the potential energy okay now i can say if this is s and this is h obviously the distance covered in this time is s minus h okay so obviously here u is 0 so if i apply kinematical equation for this part i can say v square is equal to u square plus 2 as Well, definitely u is zero, so this is going to be two g bracket s minus h s v square. So now let's say this is equation number one. Now we know kinetic energy is three times the potential energy, so kinetic energy will be half m v square, and three times potential energy will be m g h h is the height from the surface. So obviously m gets cancelled. I'm going to put v square as this because I have equation number one over here. So half into two g bracket s minus h is equal to three g h. So two cancel, g cancel. I get s is equal to h plus three h four h, which means the height at that instant is going to be s by four. Now once you get this height as h by four, I can re-substitute this value in equation one. So I get v square is equal to 2g in the bracket s minus s by 4 that is nothing but 3 s by 4 so 3 s by 4 2g into 3 s by 4 make this as 2 yani v ho jayega in the bracket root of 3g s by 2 so height as s by 4 and velocity as root 3g s by 2 is our final answer